It's time to work that core again with a new exercise that not only utilizes dumbbells, but works the stability muscles of the core. Today's video covers the core exercise of the dumbbell handoff. What's up, T-Botters? This is Ty from tbotfitness.com, the best personal training and fitness website that gets you the right fitness information to achieve your goals in the most healthy way and in the shortest amount of time. On this channel, I cover exercise and nutrition tutorials and vlogs to get you looking and feeling your best, so consider subscribing. The dumbbell handoff requires you to have at least one dumbbell or some sort of small weight such as a weight plate or a sandbag. The dumbbell handoff is a great core stability move that works the transverse abdominis muscles in the core, as well as some activation of the rectus abdominis muscles, which are also in the core. The starting position for the dumbbell handoff is lying on your back in a pronated position with your legs bent at a 90 degree angle and your dumbbell above your head. Begin the exercise by grabbing the dumbbell and pulling it with straight arms over your body until you are crunching. You will then be placing it on your legs by your feet, which are still bent at a 90 degree angle. Once you have placed the dumbbell on your legs, return your torso to a flat supinated position on the ground while you brace your core and extend your legs as close to the ground as you can. From there, you will want to bring your legs back to the 90 degree position and crunch up to then retrieve the dumbbell and place it back to the starting position above your head. You will then repeat this process for repetitions. There are many things to make sure of while you are performing this exercise. The first of which is to ensure that you are bracing your core the entire time. If you are feeling the exercise more in your legs or more in your low back, it does not mean that you are hurting yourself it just means that your core is already tired and that you need to move down in weight or try an alternative. A good regression for this exercise is to switch to a physio ball, which changes the movement merely slightly because it requires you to hold the physio ball between your legs. This is also referred to as a slightly different exercise known as the physio transfer, which will work similar muscles to the dumbbell handoff. Progression for the dumbbell handoff is quite easy. It simply requires you to move up the weight in which you are stacking on your legs. A good alternative is to continue to stack plate weights on your legs with each repetition. This keeps the exercise fresh and allows you to track your progress. All right, T-Botters, now you know how to properly perform the dumbbell handoff, which as you can see, is able to be performed in a variety of different ways. If you learned something new today, hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. Sound off in the comments below if you would like to see other videos on topics or exercises like this one covered in future videos. Make sure to hit that bell icon so you never miss another video upload from me. If you are looking for a routine that tones the core and gets you that flat stomach you have always wanted, head on over to tbotfitness.com. At tbotfitness.com we are dedicated to helping you improve your life. We offer online personal training, online nutritional coaching, and one-on-one -on -one or group local training. Feel free to check out our website and leave your email in the box on the main page to get started with your fitness journey today. Remember that success is achieved by staying consistent and always making the next right choice. That's tbotfitness.com. Finish strong.